Learning maths doesn't come easy to all of us, but what if you could combine it with football? In the UK, it's well known that we love football, but there is a numeracy problem. With the numbers game, what they're doing is they're using the, the children's heroes, your Cristiano Ronaldo's, Neymar's, Messi's, and they're, they're, they're using stats and information about these type of players, so the kids are going to be engaged. How many finals have there been since? YouTube star Jeremy Lynch is using his football skills to help these children from Hammersmith with their maths. Lionel Messi, uh, 110 runs per match. Cristiano Ronaldo, 95. I find things like um, graphs difficult, sometimes algebra, um, and a bit of decimals as well, finding the percentage. Football um, helps people learn maths because you know, football is a really big platform, so more people are more um, kind of interested and engaged in football, more they are in maths, and bringing those two together might help people and motivate people. From recording the speed of your goals to budgeting for your favourite team. The numbers game aims to engage young people and get them to open up about their struggles with maths. We're trying to get people to move away from numbers and maths being something they did at school to realise that it's part of everyday life and you do need to engage with numbers if you want to make good decisions. I love the way that we could use numbers to uh, experience the way that football works. It's difficult but sometimes you just have to persevere. I think today it really helped show me that maths is really important in life. It is difficult to admit that you're struggling in maths because you want to seem like everything's fine but if, if you speak up now then it will benefit you later in life. The numbers game is engaging children's minds with numbers in a way that you just can't do in the classroom. It's really clever, it's really clever. Jem O'Reilly, BBC London News.